Department of Homeland Security unconstitutional border checkpoint. Looks like that's what we have here. I didn't realize there was one way out here. That's strange. We're not even close to the border. I think we're within the hundred miles, sadly. Sense. <clears throat> didn't think there was one here either. They must have just put it in. Dad? Dad Daddy locked the door, don't worry. I don't remember if it was here last time or not. I don't think it was. Are you still recording? Yep, we're still recording. Make sure we got a backup in case it stops. Okay. Set this to video mode. Okay, and just set it down in your lap. Cyrus, you're gonna have to wait, baby. Got the guy on the computer here. Yeah, waste of money. Now, most of us weren't around in Nazi Germany, but what we see here in America these days is these checkpoints where they just stop us at the border, ask questions, and, and pressure us. Um, they violate the Constitution by demanding that we answer questions, and the real question is, am I being detained? Yes. On what grounds am I being detained? Constitution. The Constitution. I'm being detained. Come here. This is, this is C. Castine. I'm being detained on grounds of the Constitution. That's a new one on me, actually. So, they're stopping us for no apparent reason. We're just traveling the highway as U.S. citizens. And here we are cruising along. This guy is, is so out of touch with the law that he says I'm being stopped and detained on the grounds of the Constitution. This is yeah. we are He's getting a video court. camera now. Excellent, yeah. excellent. Great, great. So More video cameras are better. We're being stopped because of the Constitution. Just bear with us here. We're going to see how this develops. Here's a second camera. Make sure this is handy in case we need it. In fact, let's pull the GoPro down too. Well, I can only hold two many cameras at once. You can use that one as well. I'm just going to put this right here. Okay. Just so we have a secondary. Okay. And uh, look, he's got a camera too. You got a camera too. What is it? What brand is it? Am I being detained? Yes. On what grounds? On what grounds am I being detained? Answer the question. What? So they've, uh, uh, they're currently illegally detaining me and my family, not anywhere near to the, the border, and they won't let us go. We'll see what happens. If you pull forward, your tires are going to flatten. They say if we pull forward, our tires are going to flatten. Huh. How? Because they're being buttheads. We have three kids in the car. Let's go ahead and roll off the window here. Do you have any ID? Am I being detained? Do you have an ID? Am I being detained? You good? Okay, have a good day. Oh, no, 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 wait, wait. Because <laughs> yeah, if you ruin my tires, you're paying for them. Yeah, we will pay for them. That's good. I'm glad to hear that. Next time you violate our constitutional have rights... Day. Have a good day. Look at that. I didn't answer any questions. Guess what? They do nothing. I will. We're telling you to move, now you're, now you're stopping my traffic. You stopped my traffic okay, illegally. Thank you. Go ahead. Have a good day. I will move at my pace. You have a good one. So yes, I was a little pushy, but I've had it. Here's the thing. What this proves is what I was wondering. I don't have to answer any other questions. I didn't tell them I was a US citizen. I didn't give them my ID. I didn't pull forward or allow them to search my vehicle or anything like that. They were very belligerent, but in a calm way. I mean, they were clearly not liking what I was doing. And yet here we are, we are still recording, right? Yeah. Roll up the window. The audio is probably not very good, but at least we had decent, decent light. So here's this unconstitutional checkpoint. I was stopped, and they told me I was being detained on grounds of the Constitution. The last time I checked, that wasn't grounds for detainment in the United States. I'm, I'm not sure. I mean, maybe we have a new Constitution now. But here I am with my family in the super camper, and we're moving down the road. 
one more checkpoint behind us. Um, what this tells me is I no longer answer any of their questions because I wondered if for some strange loophole, if I, if I didn't tell them if I was a U.S. citizen, if they could arrest me, I didn't know what would happen today. They didn't, and here we are. So, yay, we're still free citizens apparently, and I guess that's all. Now we're moving on to White Sands. I'm Gavin Syme, American pictorialist. Uh, just because I'm an artist doesn't mean I'm not a conservative, that I don't value freedom and the Constitution. And when my own government tramples on that, I will treat them with the disdain that they deserve, as will the rest of my family. Anna and Cyrus and Asher. And I, I wonder just what would happen if they had, like, tasered me and arrested us or something. I mean, that would have been quite interesting with all the kids and stuff. So... One more adventure down on the road. Why is the camera crooked? It's not. Okay, anyways. Take care, people. When you reach checkpoints, refuse to answer any questions. This, is, this isn't a border crossing. That's different. I'm, I'm all for reasonable protection of our borders. This is an inland checkpoint in violation of the Constitution. The Supreme Court has ignored the fact that we're being stopped and detained without probable cause because they decided that it was a worthy reason to do so. Last time I checked, the Constitution was a far more worthy reason than any of these things. So that's where I stand. Where do you stand? It's time for all of us to start sticking out our necks a little bit and taking a stand so that none of us have to get them chopped off. <laughs>